Some may ask, what do you really do, Bran? You just make stupid videos on the internet. Well, I want to come back at you guys saying, hey, guess what? Once you watch this full video, you're going to know that I'm here for the boys and I'm here to help whenever I can. If anything, this video makes me look like a god once you watch the whole thing because let me tell you, I'm doing some person a real nice act today. My time isn't free either, so this is really actually a big deal. I charge eight dollars an hour, bitch! <laughs> Boys, long time no talk. Holiday season, spend time with my friends and family. Now it's back to the real family, you guys. You know, the ones that give me lots of money sometimes. <laughs> Just kidding. Back in action, we're back in the action, boys. Man, the thrift store. What a weird place. You find a bunch of random shit. And there and sometimes you just, like, you just don't know what to do with it, at least me, I just go in and buy a bunch of stuff, I bring it home, I'm like, this all looks awful. Looks cooler alongside all the worst things in the thrift store, this popped out to me anyway, I don't thrift anymore, I can't. However, sometimes in the thrift store, boys, you find something that, that tickles your fancy and it doesn't suck. So that's my viewer that actually sent us a package. Now this guy, <laughs> first off, you guys know I love you, we, uh, I love uh, doing videos that have to do with you guys sending stuff in and I send it back you want blah 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 <laughs> like you don't just send it in and I take it you know what I mean but like sometimes you do and then I you say to take it and I do and then I give it away but <laughs> where are we going thumbs up comment down below not getting shared on the algorithm because I'm not posting as much right now uh, because I'm not getting shared on the algorithm and that like puts me back so I have to spend more time selling NFTs to make money <laughs> I'm a loser I never thought I'd say anything like that anyway buddy hit us up long story short on the Instagram saying hey man I thrift slash pawn shop in thing for a living he goes to these places like thrift stores and pawn shops and try to find these things that the people at the thrift store don't know what they're selling or the people giving it into the thrift store where are you going with this anyway he specializes in like finding cool products for a shop and stuff like that and what he uh, says he does really well is he finds real diamonds at thrift stores sometimes like real diamond jewelry he hit me up he sounds like a really smart guy I don't know what he's doing watching my videos but he said Brand, I think I just found some real diamonds at the thrift store I'd love to send it in to you of course I'm gonna send it back to him <laughs> I argued him I don't want to send this back if it's real bro just kidding now I'm gonna send it back to him if it's real or if it's not real but uh, he uh, he found what he thinks to be real diamonds at the thrift store. He hasn't, from what he said, diamond tested it yet. Of course we love diamond tests and of course we love surprises. He didn't send me any pictures of this. We have been talking for a while. Uh, so I do know that this isn't a scam. He's not sending me SHIT in the mail or anything like that. He just uh, sent us a piece of jewelry with diamonds on it. It could be a damn watch, ring, chain, I don't know boys. But we're gonna diamond test this thing and see if this guy came out all right. Boys, welcome to the diamond testing challenge of a life. Uh, what fucking thrift store is stupid enough to sell the diamonds? It's like the main thing we're trying to get at. Real diamonds. Let's go. <laughs> I like surprises, bro. That's the only reason I agreed to this. And hopefully I can help the boy out. And package engaged. Like I said, I trust this guy. I, uh, I'm feeling right now, I swear to God, I feel a chocolate bar and I, I feel a little something else. So I don't, I mean, at first when I got this package, you know, I'm like, there's no way this dude just duped me. But I still got a chocolate bar out of it, I guess. But instead, okay. Yeah! Oh, there is a chocolate bar, sorry. I don't need chocolate anymore, or at least I don't let myself buy it. Sweet, we got the damn arrow bar. Thank you so much, buddy. And let's get into the next thing, which I did. Oh, and it's in a pouch, which means it might be a ring. You guys know I like rings more than anything. I like my chains, I like my watches. The rings are the, are the best, it's not a ring. It might be a ring, it might be a ring. So here it is, boys, once again, thrift store. I didn't frick, how much did he pay for it? Okay, so it was a little more hefty for a thrift store. It was 49, or uh, I think it was a thrift store. I wrote down the amount it was. It might've been a pawn shop, damn it. 49.99, it's a little hefty. We're gonna see, we're gonna, we're gonna do our research here. Boys, if you're correct on if this passes or not, leave it down below. Just comment your guess, and I hope you're not lying and just watch through the video, then say the right thing. What the hell am I gonna do? Message me on Instagram. I'm probably gonna follow a bunch of you back. I just did a, like a few Christmas giveaways So I can't give away anything right now, but message me on the Instagram and I'll just follow a bunch of you back Okay, cool boys without further ado. Here's the sack nice little sack by the way, bro You can tell this guy does this for a living. This might be bull bull scrotum bull scrotum if I know my My yeah, my leathers correct. There's definitely a testicle in there at one point boys. Oh, it's small Okay, so it's a necklace and with the 
damn. With a diamond. We got diamonds right here. Okay, so it's not really boy style. This looks like a damn flower, bro. I wish you could have warned me that this is only for chicks. <laughs> Just kidding. Sorry, I don't know. Anyway, this is that right there. Main goal, boys, is to test this. Now, I screwed up. I thought that in this video we were going to go to my, my boy's shop and test it like with his real, real diamond tester. But uh, they're actually closed today. So I'm going to do that for him before I ship it off regardless. But what we do have for now is the regular one. Now, i got to take a quick look at this. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'd call myself an expert, but not a, a, uh, not a savant, you know? Where's my f***ing micro glass? You know, it works a little bit, actually. This is great. It really does. Get yourself a shot glass, kids. <laughs> that actually looks really, really damn good, bro. I don't know. There's a lot of good deck. Because it's not completely perfect, it makes me think that it's not 100% a fake. Because generally, the, the fakes are 100% perfect. If you look, if look at my girl's uh, engagement ring, for example. It's a big piece. In order to make it like a lot like better, and like clearer, I'd have to spend like hundreds of thousands of dollars on it. So like, I like how it doesn't have tons. Of, I'm not really feeling what was that. That's an easy E one. I think we're gonna go with the big E. Oh yeah, that one works a little better. Yeah, okay. So I see what we're looking at here, boys. I actually brought my little washcloth right here, which is a uh, just an icebox case. Dip this up a little bit, and then we're gonna freaking diamond test it. Boys, if this comes out real, the reason I want it to come out real is because one, it's a good title. Two, we could say, hey, brother, you freaking like, you gem. You just got a freaking, how much did I say? $49.99, I think it was. You just got a good amount of diamonds because I'm touching it right now. I'm allowed to name the price, probably at least $10,000 worth of diamonds for fr freaking free, pretty much, bro. All right, so let's just do this. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy these types of videos. I really like, uh, I like helping people out mostly. Uh, when it really comes down to it, you know, there's a lot of people out there that are in need of Brad. No, um, I just, uh, I just like surprises. Uh, the chain we haven't really talked about. It's not that sick to me. It's not my style. But if it's real diamonds, it's real diamonds. You feel what I'm saying? And I just touched the damn thing. We gotta rub it off. Get, ah! Not the ball sack with this. I'm gonna scratch the diamonds. Okay, let's just go. I think it might be real, bro. Oh. Oh, ooh. Okay, better clean, better clean. I'm gonna come back, cause this thing's mad dirty. <sighs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right, boys, she's clean. My wiener's hard, ready for blast off. Don't, don't ever say that again. Boys, good. Come on, big guy. Okay, so that's good. That's good. That's very good, bro. I don't know. I just slipped a little bit, so I want to make sure I'm doing this 100% correct for you, bro. Okay, so I'm testing the middle one. I don't know. I really want this to work for you, man. It's going up, but not enough, bro. Maybe I gotta reconfigure it now. Well, let's just try one more time. Straight from the strip thrift store, boys. Almost said strip club. Which wouldn't be a bad idea right now. Okay, so that looks good. I don't think I let it settle down though before I tried it again. One more. I don't know, man. I think I'm gonna chalk that up as like <sighs> real <laughs> for the title. Just kidding. I don't know, man. I'm gonna take this in uh, tomorrow. If you guys want an update on the next video, I'll take it into the jeweler that I know and uh, we'll redo it. But I think it looks good. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe not, too. Anyway, boys, that's that. I mean, uh, I hope, uh, yeah, I hope that goes well for them. That, just a little surprise in the box, and you guys know I like these. I hope you guys like them, too. If not, tell me to screw off, and we'll never do it again. Bye. Love you.